Oh, it's a beautiful day in Scottawa. And Scottapeg. Uh, and Scottsylvania. You know, Scott Alexandria. And Thebes. Well, I'm a little bit nervous about Thebes, actually. Um, mainly because of him. <laughs> I'm a little bit nervous that we're going to lose Thebes. Uh, I was looking at the terrain here. I don't know what we're going to do about him. I have a battleship, actually. Um, he's going to be a problem. Uh, I was just sort of surveying the land, because if we lose Thebes, uh, Thebes is going to be in resistance for 16 turns. It means it's not going to be healing too much. Um, can they bombard me? Oh, with a fighter. Sure thing, sure thing. They definitely can. Uh, so I don't want them to be able... I don't want um, what's their faces, these people, to be able to take it if I do lose it, which mean I'll, as long as you don't move, you're a hill. I don't think they can move into the same tile as my great general. So I think this should block them from doing so. In case we do fail. I'm really worried about losing Thebes. Can you even get here? What's your range? I think your range is three. It better be three. Otherwise we're screwed. Your range is three. Oh, and you kill it. Oh, oh, beautiful. Oh, okay. So now you only have that. And I don't think that can kill me. Okay. Okay. Crisis averted. Whew. It's a beautiful day. <laughs> let's, um... Let's, uh... I guess move like that, kind of. We're, we're, we need to set up a new line. Um, I'm a little bit worried. Let's make sure that Thebes becomes mine. Oh, it stayed, it stayed mine. We're okay. That's the thick of it. We made it past the thick of it. Whoa, something shot my battleship. Oh, I've got no idea what it was. You'll pay for this. Somebody attacked Tyson? Sons of bitches. Um, I've made a declaration of friendship with one of their enemies. Uh, sorry. <laughs> but uh, if <laughs> one of the people I've made a declaration of friendship with is your enemy, that means that uh, they're a lot more powerful than you. Um, oh, Jesus. Okay, well now I've got a huge line of defense defending me from <laughs> from Memphis. From any Egyptian influence. So I'm pretty sure Thebes is ours now. That was scary. That was scary. Okay. You've been promoted. I don't know what attacked you. So I'm going to move you into Thebes to defend you. And then I'm going to say naval units. And we're going to fortify... Uh, we're going to fortify you until healed. You can just automate. Uh, you can move up as well as you. I suppose this is going to be a log jam, eh? It's not going to be much opportunity for me to uh, enter into this one the same. Maybe I can sneak in there, but I highly doubt Memphis is going to last. Although it's going to take them a couple turns. I don't know. I might luck out. I don't think I'm going to be as lucky as I was with Thebes. But we can try. We're going to try. It would be really nice to mooch, mooch another city off of my allies here. Or ally singular. Indonesia didn't really have much to do with this one. Uh, we are going to relocate you two. Come on. You know you want to. There we go. And uh, you're going to fortify if you can. You're going to fortify as well. 
That's right, we got a whole bunch of uh, moolah when we plundered Thebes, eh? We're going to move our Great War Infantry there, and then we're going to move you in behind it. Um, maybe we actually move you down around here. And uh, we will set you up and alert you, and you will fortify. Okay, you're going to heal. I've got so many units. <laughs> I don't know what to do with them all. Uh, you're not yet in range. You actually need to be on this line to be in range. So we'll just do nothing with you guys this turn. And what am I choosing now? Uh, production for Scottawa. Ooh, I can... Oh, uh, right, because I captured Thebes and it has all the coal. Perfect. Okay... We need more production in this city. You know what? That means you can build a factory too, does it not? Yes, it does. And that means the same for you, but we'll wait the two turns for that great war infantry. I don't know if we'll need all these uh, troops. We certainly will if uh, if Portugal decides she doesn't like the look of my face. Um, uh, looks like... We didn't get assaulted on Thebes, so that's good. Let's see what Portugal does. Are you moving on Memphis? I'm sure we're going to see a lot of troops all of a sudden move. Yeah, and you're attacking it. Like little troopers. Look at all the movements, man. Just an insane amount. Okay, so... I can move you there. I can move you there. Um... You know, we might actually luck out Bratislava. Bratislava, your fucking submarines are in my way, man. Okay, uh, alert you. Oh, uh, you can go there. Can you go beyond that? Doesn't look like you can, no. So let's just... You do nothing. Um, you set up, I suppose. Move there so you could get into one of those. But it, it's a log jam. I really don't... I don't see myself being able to do anything here. But we'll try. Alright. Uh, gold to Gary. You've got a lot of stuff here. A lot of destroyers and battleships. And a whole bunch of things. Um... Yeah, you are constructing that over you. I only got the one battleship, eh? Just the one? Oh, do I have another one? I thought I was making another one, was it not? Are you, like, permanently really close to building a battleship? Yeah, you are, but I needed oil. That's interesting. Okay. Uh, so I must have lost... Oh, you know what it was? I lost this guy's oil. That's what it was. Uh, you can't move there anymore. That's what you're complaining about. So just move there and wait. More artillery to be commanded. We'll move you there. And you're moving there, I'm sure. Okay. How do you own that? I guess from you, there wasn't any terrain for that city to pop. Because all of this was owned by Thebes and all this... By Scott Alexandria. Assyria lost its capital. Fled. Hmm. So that spy needs to be reassigned. Whoa. Things are attacking and going and. Okay, um. Yeah. Well, you seem to be. Oh, I can come here, can I? No, I can't. Can I go there? No, I can't. Ah, shit. Uh. Oh dear. <laughs> can't do anything with that unit now. Um. Okay, so you fled. Uh, so you is is Assyria dead now? No, you're not dead. But I've got a spy and. And that, which is going to be not so hot. Um, hmm. 
I should probably spy on more of the Netherlands if I had the chance, but I, I really don't have the chance. <sighs> You're still establishing surveillance. You're not even going to last. Let's, um... Where is... Where is your capital? It's not Istanbul. It's Jakarta. You know what? Let's spy on my allies. <laughs> Let's do it. Let's, uh... So you move there as a spy. You move... Uh, to Lisbon? Is that what it is? I'm pretty sure it's Lisbon. There's a spy. And uh, we just full out spy on my allies. Because we have nothing better to do with our time. So, 50% of culture, something, something. Gold is nice. Uh, Musicians Guild doesn't help me at all. <laughs> we don't need any of that, apparently. Uh... So I suppose we get stock exchange. All right. Great War Infantry was completed here. Where are we going with this now? Factory in 10 turns. Whoop. Now we're completed a mint. So stock exchange. Let's do it. Okay. Okay. Still in resistance <laughs> for 13 turns. You can't do anything. You can go there, which is where we want you. And I think that's it. Nope. Nope. You're now healed. Um, we'll move you into the fray just in case uh, you can't do anything either uh, neither can you or you you can move there if that helps at all uh, we found a natural wonder so that's something I, I can't do anything with you like I literally can't I don't know what it wants me to do I can't. No. I'm not declaring war on Maria. That's what you want me... Are, are you making me... You're forcing me to delete this unit? Really? I can't... I'm not declaring war on Maria. Who's Bratislavia allied with? Ugh. <sighs> <laughs> um fuck I guess I gotta I have to delete the unit is that what you're selling yeah that's what you're telling me <sighs> Jesus okay let's uh re get everybody over there so that you're in relevance here because if I'm going to be betrayed, uh, well, I suppose it could come from Giza as well. I'm, I am furious about this. It's making me... That's so weird. It didn't make me delete the rifleman when it was all screwed up and on that. That's frustrating. It's frustrating. So trusting of uh, Maria. I don't have anything stationed in Giza. Doesn't look like she has anything stationed near me either. She, I mean, she's got troops running through my territory, but... <sighs> it's really disconcerting. That means I'm definitely not winning the Memphis sweepstakes. Although, to be fair, I'm guessing it's going to be taking this turn anyways, but... Uh, yeah, where did the... So if I had left my ship there, I might have... Keyword might have uh, won the sweepstakes. Nope, definitely wouldn't have. It's really unfortunate. Mm. Oh well. <laughs> I think Egypt is dead. Egypt is dead. Assyria is almost dead. So that's fun. Um. Most literate people. How far away from my... You know, I'm actually not as far as I thought I was. Huh. I'm actually not as far as I thought I was. Okay, so... With Egypt dead... Um, I don't really know what that means as far as who our next enemy is going to be. I'm a little bit worried that... Um, 
that question is going to be answered by Maria in a way which um, identifies me <laughs> is one way to say it. Uh, I'm concerned as to what her feelings towards me are going to be over the next few turns. Um, I mean, Thebes is fairly well guarded. I mean, I, I do have troops. I have a fair number of troops. Um, I just don't know if I'd be able to survive a uh, Portuguese assault. We'll see. Uh, we're going to have to do next turn because we're not chilling there. And you're going to have to uh, move over here, I guess. <sighs> All right. I need to assign delegates. What am I signing for? Either historical landmarks or... Uh, well, we'll vote against um, the Dutch because screw the Dutch. Uh, we'll commit the delegates. There we go. And then we'll go... I'm pretty sure this game's going to be ending soon. I I don't see... And the only question is, is it going to be before <laughs> I get killed or after? Um, somebody's going to win, though. Although, if all of a sudden it's just me and my two allies who control my capital, or who, who control our capitals, it's gonna be interesting um gonna be interesting i think i could defend myself i mean i've got the superior tactics to the computer we saw that when egypt totally outnumbered me there in the third war with them um I, i'm still loving the fact that i was able to poach thebes though that's just amazing so happy about that. Oh, it's great. Okay, what's going on here? Sugar to Gary ended. Our battleship should probably go there. Uh, you can go there. You can go there for now. We're actually going to hopefully move the artillery there and move this there. And then we probably want a couple more. Um... Great War Infantry in that vicinity. Yeah, and we're going to want a couple more artillery and a couple more infantry guarding you. and Probably the same down here. Uh, historical Landmarks was passed, so that's unfortunate. And then uh, National Heritage Site was not passed. That's interesting. Okay. Great War Infantry, so let's just fortify you. We're going to do nothing with you and nothing with you. Where are we on victory conditions? Uh, victory progress. Two players who completed the Apollo program. Okay. Um, this is all... Gajamata controls three original capitals. Oh, that's interesting. Hey, I've got a domination point because I control Thebes. That's interesting. Okay. Okay. Uh, if I were to go into culture, because culture is the one that can really, uh, really surpass people and sneak up on people. He's popular. Okay, so the Netherlands is actually getting kind of close. <laughs> Dominant. Uh... Oh, that's interesting. No unrest time and no population loss. Oh, well, that's interesting. Okay. Wow. Huh. Dominant reached at 200%. Yeah, people are quite dominant over me. Um, <laughs> hmm. Uh... All right, so it doesn't look like anybody's close to... It doesn't look like 
anybody's close to a cultural victory. So that's the one that can really sneak up and uh, all of a sudden somebody wins. Okay, so now someone... Whoa, 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 what just happened? That was not supposed to happen, whatever it was. Uh, you guys can't do anything. Uh, you can set up an alert. Uh, you are going to move up here now. You weren't supposed to do that. You're going to move over there. Uh, you can fortify. You can fortify. Okay. All right. I don't know what's left to do on this game then. What uh, what our goals can be. Attainable, reachable goals. It's 1907. Um, frankly, we're just kind of on par with where we should be as far as technology is concerned. Um, new research agreement. Eh? Did we ever sign another research agreement with uh, Indonesia? I don't know that we did. I don't know that we did. Portugal has denounced the Netherlands. That's not surprising. You've got a lot of... <laughs> Uh, aircraft stationed right next to me. Um, so I'm really hoping you don't stab me in the back. If you stab me in the back, I'm pretty much toast. Uh, not much I'm going to be able to do. Are we constructing that or what? Research agreement, complete defensive pact with them, ended. Maria is plotting against Attila, and so is Gajamata. <laughs> hey, Attila, guess what? Oh, You're yeah. totally dead. Uh, so, uh, just so you know. <laughs> nice knowing you is all I'm saying. <sighs> Just for sh shits and giggles, should I, like, should I declare war? <laughs> I mean, maybe. I would be swamped. There would be no way. Because look at all the ships, right? Like, they'd take all my coastal cities. I was thinking for our next playthrough, um, we'll play on a smaller map. We'll play Deity again. Uh, we'll play on a smaller map, though, and uh, what we'll do, because I either have to do one of two things. I need to prevent Scottapeg from happening again. Hey, CN Tower. Um, hopefully it doesn't have any cracks in it. I need to prevent Scottapeg from doing it, uh, from that happening again, and so I either need to focus on a navy as well i don't know where i'm going to get the time to do that uh, i don't i don't know where i'm going to get the time to do that that's the only thing um because we spent we like we needed to spend the research advancing what army we did we got the jump on a on Alex on uh, Ramses at Alexandria because we had more swordsmen than him you know like where where do the turns go into building a navy the other thing i could do is i could say to myself you know what i'm never leaving the continent and i could put all my cities rather than on the coast one tile away from the coast so that naval units can't capture them that's one strategy I could do, but there's so many benefits you get from having a coastal city. But then again, what benefits have I used? <laughs> what benefits have I used this game? Fuck, I haven't even had work boats. You know, the benefits are when you've got a city like Arskatsa here who can reach, you know, potentially three sea resources and you have work boats on them, and then you have a lighthouse and a, and a harbor and a, and a seaport, and you get all kinds of benefits from working those tiles. I haven't fucking built any of that. I don't even have work boats on these tiles. Have I at any point in the game? I don't think so. I don't think I ever built a work boat. And that's because we were constantly at war. We were constantly having to focus on other things. So I don't know if that's feasible. This guy's just chilling right where I want to put. And same with that guy. Hopefully they're just healing and... And once they're full, they're going to move on. Uh, okay. You'll pay for that in time. In time. Don't worry. I'm cooking something up. Um, 
so yeah, there's different ideas, different ideas as to uh, what we can do. Whoa! Oh, man. Oh, it's... Oh, my goodness. Oh, dear. Oh, that's... That's actually, um... Oh. She wants to declare war on Gary. You know what that means? That means she's looking at him as a threat. Oh, I can't, I can't declare war on Gary. Gary's got all kinds of shit outside my, uh, territory. Look at all that. He would take these cities instantly. I can't declare war on Gary. Uh, Sedan's granted me a unit. Culture victory contender. What does that even mean? The Netherlands only needs their culture to come become influential with two more civs to win a culture victory. Oh, is that because, uh, yeah, that's because of Syria. Um, that's because of Syria is dead, so everybody's freaking out because all of these, these three only need to be influential with two other civs. The problem is, that's those three. Um, so the game's just freaking out right now. Because they're influential over me and Attila. Oh man. Um, so plastics I'm gonna get in two turns anyways. Uh what's my other choice? Railroad. Uh, yeah, so railroad is my only choice. Okay. Wow, ten, thirteen, and sixteen, and we steal three technologies. Pop pop pop. Alright, two ideology. Okay. Happiness from castles, arsenals, and military base. I don't have many of either of those. Purchasing units. Uh, with all non -sivs. Hmm, That's interesting. Um. Plus one local happiness from every wonder. I guess I need the wounded military units. <sighs> okay, so we've got a caravan. Um, you. Oh, and we've got a great engineer. Right, you saw that. Uh, okay, what do we do with you? What are we going to do with you? You get two culture and six faith. I don't know if that's overly useful. What's a tile, though? Where's a tile that's useless? I mean, I guess two... That's just straight up a farm on a desert. That's kind of funny. Uh, what's a city that's useless as far as production is concerned? I'm pretty sure you are. <sighs> Great War Infantry, you're fortifying there. Um, oh, you can finally do this. There we go. Uh, didn't I have another one coming down here to go where you are? If I don't, then I am going too soon. Uh, in fact, I will... You're going to start moving down there. There you go. And you're going to move there. And everybody's going to be a big happy family. Okay, so you're going to set up, and you're going to alert next turn. Excellent. Okay, so, man, Gary and Maria, they're about to be at war. Um, that means she's looking at her allies, myself included, and considering backstabbing them, because she and him have been friends. And see, he wants war with William. That makes sense. You have no idea what's coming, and there is no way for me to warn you. No way in the game for me to warn you. You know what? Yes, let's work together. Because if you declare war on him, I, I'm no longer friends with him. Because <laughs> you're closer and more of an immediate threat to me.
Why is my gold hurting so bad? Because I keep getting gifted units. Uh, what did I get gifted now? A cavalry unit? Fuck that. <laughs> um, I guess I could have gifted him to a, to a city-state and won some influence, but... Uh, Okay, so you're just doing nothing for now. You're going to alert. You're going to fortify. Okay. What's this? To enact a world leader. Uh, okay, you've done a zoo. We are hurting unhappiness. Stadiums. Man, they really nerfed stadiums. Holy cow. Stadiums used to provide four happiness. Where did that go? Okay. Next turn, well, uh, I'm sorry. Uh, I guess we'll build a manufacturing. Yeah, let's do it. Why not? Let's build it, give you the option to work in it. I don't know if you're going to. You've only got three citizens. You're kind of really crummy as far as cities go. I need um, Bug your happiness resources. Yeah, and you've got some to give muscle. me. Give me some gems. Not some gems. No, give me salt. Oh, you can't give me salt. Cloves. Some, some of my cities wanted cloves. I remember seeing that. And maybe incense. There we go. Can you give me salt? <gasps> you can give me salt. I want your salt. I don't know if people want me to get salt anymore. Are people concerned about my sodium intakes? Let me check first before I do anything. Are you concerned about my sodium? No, you're concerned about me getting silver. Are you concerned about my sodium? You still are. You still are. Oh, but I need like all of King Midas's gold. <laughs> I said gold and not silver this time. That, how did you get so much? You must have gotten bonuses for uh, for killing Egyptian units, and then you just like you literally killed all of the Egyptian units. Or just faith growth? My goodness, how how are we doing on the uh, religion overview? World religions. Let's see how we're doing. You know, I'm actually Scotwinism is second. To uh, Hinduism, but uh, we're doing quite well. Doing quite well. Is Lisbon still? No, it's still got a lot of uh, Scotoanism followers. It's sort of a mixed bag, though. Very multicultural city. Um, but Scotoanism is strong in this region. Very strong. Very strong. Excellent. All right. Next turn. So, uh, I mean, I'm not going to give up all, everything in the world for, uh, <sighs> for sodium. You want a research agreement. I so want it. I do. I also want gold, though, because I need, I need infantry, dude. Like, need it. Capital N-E-E-D, man. It's bad. You also want one, uh. Okay. No. Okay. Gold return from... Yeah, see, somebody wanted clothes. I remembered it. Okay. So we've got Thebes pretty well surrounded by units. I need some more ships for me to feel secure, but uh, how many more turns until we can rename it? I've got a good name lined up. A good name. Uh, submitted by a viewer, of course. Uh, okay, science. We can get science. Oh, everything is taking so many turns. <laughs> so many turns. Um, okay. I'd really like for like all of these cities to be mine. But uh that's okay. That's okay. <laughs> I suppose that's fine. I suppose that's fine. Okay, how how much does it cost? 120, that's actually not bad. Uh boom, boom, boom. And then we can uh get one more next turn. That makes me feel kind of safe. It's probably a false sense of security when I really think about it. <laughs> probably a false sense of security. 
You want open borders? Um, give me salt and I'll say yes, no? Okay. I don't know if I want open borders with you. You don't understand what's coming your way. <laughs> um, okay. You don't understand what's coming your way, man. It's it's bad. There's there's bad things afoot. Uh, that deal strengthened our relationship. Did it, though? Did it really? Because what I want is salt. I'm worried about my sodium. What am I doing? I should have done that and upgraded more of my units. I'm a fool. <laughs> but salt connected for... Tyson, Salt Connected for Bratislava, literally everybody. Look at how many people were concerned about my sodium. Even Scott Town was concerned about sodium. Oh, I'm so close to so many. I need another 226 for you, 191 for you, 109 for you, 249, 113, 30 for that. That was actually close. <laughs> that was the only one that was close. <laughs> it's giving me the false sense that I have so many almost allies, and no, I, I, I really don't at all. Oh, that's hilarious. Let's upgrade you, because we can. Look at how many people were concerned about it. Well, like, how did everybody get so much influence with all of the city-states? Like, are they just permanently spending gold on them? Do they have, like, nine spies? What's going on? Ugh. We need all the research labs we can get. 302 science. You know, that's actually a shit ton of science. I don't know if I'm crazy, but, like... Is it costing more for me? Like, I, I really did not feel the effects of uh, Scholars in Residence. That really... Nope. Not feeling the effects of Scholars in Residence at all. You need orders. You can just straight up fortify. Oh, dear. I, I feel secure about Thebes. That might change in the near future. That might change. <laughs> um... All right. Defensive pact. You want it. So do I, kind of. Watch me give some world leader votes for, like, the Huns or something. Where are we? They need 39 votes to win. You know, once William is out of the picture, there's going to be a lot of city-states. Uh... One, two, three, four. If William is out of the picture, it would be really funny if William and Maria were out of the picture because I might all of a sudden become allies with most, if not all, of the city-states and then maybe be able to just totally bullshit a diplomatic victory. That would be hilarious. Regardless of how funny that would be, though, that's going to be the end of this turn. Thebes is ours. It's still resisting our control. So we're going to have to wait to name it next time. Um, yeah. So let me know in the comments what you'd like to see next time. Um, and hell, if you have if you have comments about uh, different strategies we might take, you know, maybe we try to be as peaceful as we can and we only have a few cities that are very defendable and we try to get a cultural victory. I don't know how possible that would be on Deity. Um, but hell, we can try. I don't know. The only thing, the only reservation I have about getting a cultural victory is that can be very, very slow. Um, I mean, you know, the war just, the wars just kind of fell onto my lap in this game. I didn't have to go searching for them like I did in the last playthrough. Thanks in large part due to deity. <laughs> but uh, it was, it, it's been an interesting playthrough. I really love, the thing I love about this game is the connection you feel for your country. You know, you you really feel a connection. Like I, I really, really wanted Scott to peg back. And I'm so happy that we got it. All right. So, without further ado, see you all next time.